fucking pathetic, thirsty ass, motherfucking dried up. You fucking rolled into fucking Dree's scope yesterday and thinking that you were going to fucking make nicey nice and you got fucking put on blast like a bitch. You got fucking laughed at and fucking joked right out of the fucking beam. You thought you were going to fucking go in there and make nicey nice. You know, like other people like Jeff and Stormy and, uh, well, for fuck's sakes, there was a whole fucking list of people, really. There was really a whole list of people. Sorry that only Jeff and Stormy's names come out at the moment. All you fucking ass licking fuck fucks. You're all fucking trash. Dree with her fucking scope about fucking, oh, did you see Amy's scope? Johnny's a legit stalker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should call the police on Johnny. You fucking dumb fucking mentally ill fucking psychopath. You sound like you need a dick up your fucking ass. Go get one. You people are fucking out there, man. Seriously. And Dree last night with all her little viewers. Oh, this is what I've been waiting for, you guys. For three years, I've been waiting for this. I've been waiting to have you people in my scope. I've been waiting to have trash boxes like fucking Brian and Sprinkles in my fucking beam and Rame. I've been waiting for so long. Y'all are fucking idiots. Really? I've been, this is what I've been, no, that's what she said. This is what I've been waiting for for three years, you guys. Yeah, you know, all those scopes that she fucking deletes but thinks somehow they're fucking erased from existence. Not. I don't give a fuck if I'm down to four people in my fucking scopes. Do you understand me? I will block out every fucking piece of trash that I look at and recognize. I can't, I can't stick up for what I fucking, you know, for what people have done to my friends because, you know, I just can't, you know, I'm sick. I'm not strong enough. I'm too busy. I'm a, I'm just a shitty person, so I don't care. So that's why I make no fucking boundaries in my fucking scopes. That's why I have no fucking, um, that's a, it is popcorn. Absolutely. This is why I have no fucking care or concern of the type of fucking people around me. The people that, are doing all that thrive for that fucking attention. They thrive for what they're getting off that. Yeti can run around saying that fucking I get paid to do anything on this fucking app. The only fucking thing I've ever been paid to do on this app was a fucking joke. And it was a fucking $5. It was $5 to block somebody. And it was somebody blocking their own friend. Somebody wanting to block their own friend out of fun. I know y'all don't know what fun is because you're too busy living in your goddamn misery. Sitting on fucking Periscope on Memorial Day. While the messages just roll through about the fucking misery and discontent y'all fucking sit and spew and then laugh at it like uh, it's supposed to somehow be fun. You people are fucking idiots. I don't ask anybody not to fucking, uh, I don't ask anybody to fucking block, but if, if, if I see you fucking being accepting of some bullshit, 
and I block you, don't fucking cry about it. People want the popularity, the numbers. Oh my God, it's about the numbers. This is what I've been waiting for, you guys. I've been waiting for people to buy my dog's treats. Bitch, your dogs weigh three pounds and seven pounds. How many motherfucking treats are they gonna motherfucking eat? You fucking liar with all your fucking money that you don't have. That you never fucking had. Your goddamn dogs weigh 10 whole fucking pounds put together, bitch. I work for treats for my dogs while you sit back and you fucking trash people that have fucking PayPal or a wish list. Now you sit there asking, how do I make a wish list, you guys? I need to do that. While Reem talks about all the bags that she's got. No, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Sprinkles talks about how many purses she has. All because of her wish list of the necklaces and she remembers where every every everything came from and it's all you could you're all fucking trash and people pay you and gift you to be fucking scum. Yeah, I hold your breath for that fucking apology. No, I do hold your breath for that apology, please. You always want somebody to hold their breath for that fucking whatever it is that you know they're not going to fucking get. That way, when they hold their breath waiting on it, they'll fucking fall over dead because they held their fucking breath too long. Please hold your goddamn breath and wait. Take two seats and wait. I don't give a fuck about you, Tina. Stay the fuck away from me. If you don't like me pointing out sometimes that you fucking uh, are still the same and that you're spewing hate and discontent because you're trying to pull the wool over people's eyes that you know don't watch other things that are going on on Periscope, that's your fucking problem. You fucking said the other day on the goddamn scope. Oh, y'all, my hearts are back at 47%. So fuck you, popcorn, you bitch. I'm back and it's on, popcorn, you bitch. By the way, that's what all of this is about because I spoke up for popcorn. So here comes all the hate and discontent for all the piece of shit dirt bags that had an issue with popcorn because we're supposed to believe what the fuck you say because your credibility is so much fucking better. Sure. Sure it is. Yeah, while they've lost nothing but like makeup palettes and fucking girlfriends. Ain't nobody fucking hungry over here. Nobody needs any of you fuck fucks. But if you're going to sit around day after fucking day, Jeff. Talking your shit. 